In this life, any person to the proportionate degree of the varieties of work, either religious or irreligious, as they are performed in the next life, also the same person, to the same degree, the same variety, the resultant action of his karma must enjoy or suffer. Jena Javana Jathadharu Adharama Dharma bhi hasami hita Saiva tat phalang bhungti Tatha tavat amatra bhai So, in the previous verse we have discussed Devavan na jagarmakrit Anyone who has got this material body He has to work Everyone has to work in the spiritual body also you have to work the material body also, you have to work, because the working principle is the soul. Soul is living, force. So he is busy. Living body means there is movement, there is work. You cannot sit idly. In the Bhagavad Gita it is said, not even for a moment, one can be idle. That is the symptom of living being. So this working is going on according to the particular body. The dog is also running and a man is also running but a man thinks he is very much civilized because he is running on motor car. Both of them are running, but a man has got a particular type of body by which he can prepare a vehicle or a cycle and he can run on. He is thinking that I am running in greater speed than the dog. Therefore, I am civilized. This is the modern mental. He does not know that what is the difference between running on 50 miles speed or 5 miles speed or 5,000 miles speed or 5 million miles of speed. The space is unlimited. Whatever speed you discover, it is still insufficient. Still insufficient. So, this is not life, that because I can run in more speed than the dog, therefore I am civilized. Panthāsta kūti satavasya sampragamya bāyu rathāpi manasu munipangavāna Sapastija prapada seemna avicinta tati govinda madi purisam tamang bhajami. Our speed, what for speed? Because we want to go to certain destination. That is his speed. So the real destination is govinda. Vishnu. They're running in different speed, but they do not know what is the destination. Our one big poet in our country, Rabindranath Tagore, he wrote an article, I read it, when he was in London. So, in your country, Western countries, the motor cars and the, they run in high speed. So Ramadhanarak Thakur, your poet, was thinking that this Englishman's country is so small and they are running on so great speed they will fall in the ocean. He remarked like that. 
Why they are running so fast? So similarly, we are running so fast for going to hell. This is our position. Because we do not know what is the destination. If I do not know what is the destination and try to drive my car in full speed, then what will be the result? The result will be disaster. We must know why you are running. Just like the river is running in great tribe, flowing, but the destination is the sea. When the river comes to the sea, then its destination gone. So similarly we must know what is the destination. The destination is Vishnu, God. We are part and parcel of God. We are somehow or other, we are fallen in this material world. Therefore, our destination of life will be to go back to home, back to God. That is our destination. There is no other destination. So our Krishna consciousness movement is teaching that you fix up your goal of life. And what is that goal of life? Back to home, back to God. You are going this side, opposite side, toward the side of hell. That is not your destination. You go this side, back to God. That is our propaganda. Hare Krishna, Hare Krishna, Krishna Krishna, Hare Hare, Hare Rama.